Here is a challenge for you. Can you calculate the radius of this circle? And which method will you like to use? Comment in the comment section. Now, let's get started. We have a triangle inscribed inside a circle. And the triangle, this side is 5, this other side is 5, and down here is 6. Now, let us find the radius. Let's solve step by step. Let us call this point A. Here, B, and here, C. Now, let us draw a line from A to B, C. Let's call that point D. This line divides B, C into two equal parts. So, 6 divided by 2 will be 3. So, B, D equals to 3 and D, C equals to 3. Here, we have a right angle triangle. The apotenuse is 5 units and the base is 3 units. To find the length of AD, we have to use Pythagoras' theorem, which states that the square of the hypotenuse is equal to the sum of the square of the two other sides. So, AB squared equals to AD squared plus BD squared. So, AB squared is 5 squared equals to AD squared plus 3 squared. So, AD squared will be equal to 5 squared minus 3 squared. AD squared equals to 25 minus 9. AD squared equals to 16. AD will be equal to the square root of 16. AD equals to 4. Next, we have to extend AD to touch the circle. Let us call this point E. Remember that AD divides BC into two equal segments. So, the perpendicular line passes through the center of the circle. So, here is the center. Let's call it O. We are to find the length ED. To find ED, there are many other methods you can use, but I will be using cut rule. We said that if two cuts of a circle intersect inside the circle, then the product of the length of the segment of one cut equals the product of the length of the segment of the other cut. So, using the above theorem, AD times ED equals to BD times DC. So, AD is 4, ED is unknown, equals to BD is 3 times DC is 3. So, we have, when we calculate, we have this equals to 9 over 4. So, ED will be equals to 9 over 4. So, AD equals to 4. D E equals to 9 over 4. The diameter of this circle is A E. To find the total length of A E, we are to add A D to D E to have the diameter. When we add, we have 4 over 1 plus 9 over 4, which is equal to 16 plus 9 over 4. Now, when we add that, A E, which is the diameter, will be equal to 25 over 4. Remember that we are to find the radius of this circle. We have gotten the diameter to be 25 over 4. So, to find R, we have to divide the diameter by 2. So, R will be equal to 25 over 4 divided by 2. So, when we solve, we have this. That's 25 over 4 times 1 over 2, which will give us 25 over 8. And when we divide 25 by 8, we have 3.125. Finally, the radius of this circle is 3.125. If you have gained value in this lesson, kindly like, share, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you for watching. Bye.